Well, I've wanted to talk to you guys for a while. Um, it's something that's been playing on my mind because, uh, as you'll see by the title, why I turned to um, Buddhism um, in terms of religion. And it's more just of a spiritual um, situation, like being close with your inner self and being happy with yourself and just having a more relaxing life like meditation and things like that now okay there's some parts of the buddhist religion 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 that's not even a word religion um they're about luxuries and things like that now don't get me wrong i'm not going to be following it 100 percent, but i mean when it comes to believing in gods and things like that why not believe in a big fat man because i you know i'm fat enough to be a buddha you know i've got the tits and everything and um and the rolls the bakery rolls um no but it's a more <laughs> I, I i've got to use my words carefully um it's a it's a more healing process more spiritual and um I think what turned me to it was when was when my nan died. Um, it felt like a massive, massive loss, and she was someone I rung every single day. And sometimes I always want to be closer to her. So being spiritually um, calm and try, I'm not going to go and kill myself. Don't don't worry about that. But um, being spiritually there. You know, I don't need to read no book to be in um, this kind of re religion as such. Um, you just follow rules by treating people as you want to be treated, having like a spiritual life, um, you know, living free spirit, basically. And, you know, I've been doing meditation for years. I've I've always believed in the healing process of meditation um, I know I'm going through such anxiety at the moment, but the healing process of, you know, trying to work out my mind and thoughts and, and everything else, um, you know, this will help me. So that's why healing myself is that's why um, I chose to go down that route. I, I've been thinking about it for years. I mean, I, like I say, the luxury side of things, yeah, I'm always going to have luxuries. You can never follow something 100%. Um, but I feel that, you know, I still can have some luxuries. If you guys haven't noticed, there's a P the uh, PS4 there. It was meant to be uh, a fucking one terabyte version, bloody pro. And that all went tits up. When I sold the other one, um, <sighs> you thought you were getting a bad deal, but it turned out to be not. But I've also got an iPhone, I've got an Apple Watch, and I've got a, a computer, you know, things like that. So, you know, I'm always going to have luxuries. Um, but it doesn't mean I'm not following it. I mean, spirituality is the only way for inner peace and to go forward in life i think there's no need for to be hostile against anyone um unless it's really really worth it that's the, let's put that out of there unless it's really worth it but i've been practicing really to not get so angry not to get so afraid or upset about situations um Oh, I mean, I'm always going to worry. I'm that t worrying type, you know. Um, but this is why I'm going forward with this this uh, this religion as such. Because I've been following it on and off for months. And I thought, well, it's time to, to make myself bare kind of thing. So anyway, somewhere in these ramblings, you get what I mean. Um, I hope you're all well. Um, I hope you're all staying safe. I've had four panic attacks today, so you know, thanks so much, body. Um, but it is what it is, and I'll, I'll come fighting back again. 
there's so much going on at the minute and the stuff that i i can't mention has nothing to do with me but um it it's hard times it's hard times uh it's what we do to go forward and how we deal with it to go forward and um to be one with ourselves anyway i'm i'm just rambling see you later guys take it easy